This is episode 1544. Welcome to the Daily Meditation Podcast. I'm Mary Meckley and I'm honored you are here as you explore an affirmation for emotional stability. And this is part two of our seven part series we're exploring this week on emotional healing. We're following a very special book this week, and I hope you had a chance to listen to the Christine Carlson interview yesterday, who is the author of From Heartbreak to Wholeness. As you settle yourself down to meditate today, I'll be sharing with you from chapter one of the book where you're guided to rewrite your story. And as Christine explains in her book, it's important to rewrite your story of heartbreak from a perspective of the hero's journey rather than from a victim perspective because despite your hurt, despite your pain, you can come away empowered by your experience. And so I'll guide you through the very end of the chapter where she has what she calls a soul inquiry, commencing the journey. So go ahead now and get ready to begin your meditation. And I'll share with you the thought-provoking question to help you rewrite your story. You can find the full guided meditations on our Sip and Ohm app. They are half-hour meditations where you can meditate for 5, 10, 15, 20 minutes, all the way to half an hour. And you get guides and journals to go along with each series. And so you get an emotional healing journal for this week's series. You can try this app for two weeks free. And you have access to over 1,500 guided meditations there. So again, we have the iOS, Apple, and Android versions available for you. That's the SIP, S-I-P-A-N-D-O-M, SIP and OM app. So... The affirmation as you launch into this series is an affirmation by Swami Kriyananda who studied and learned from Paramhansa Yogananda who is the author of Autobiography of a Yogi and he has an affirmation I often say and so I thought I would share it with you for this week. It is, I am safe, I am sound, all good things come to me. I am safe, I am sound, all good things come to me. This is an affirmation I find very comforting. So just sit now for a few moments and relax your mind and body and Bring to mind the kind of healing you want to explore in this week's series. You may have pain or heartache from a relationship loss, from a divorce, from losing your health or a job or from losing a loved one. Whatever your heartbreak may be from, and you may even think, You're not really experiencing too much heartbreak these days, but you may have some unresolved pain that you could heal in this week's series. You may even feel heartache for someone else who's experiencing pain. So bring your thoughts to your healing journey this week and Mentally repeat, I am safe, I am sound, all good things come to me. 
I am safe. I am sound. All good things come to me. And notice how that settles within you. And now, as you begin your hero's journey on the path to empowerment, consider what was your crisis or event, this initiation to the pain you may be experiencing or that you experienced in the past. And how have your plans for your life changed since your crisis event? And what illusions have you been living under about love and life. And how has having these illusions pierced, broken you open? How have these illusions bursting, broken you open? And what would you need to understand, to rewrite your story, to develop a mindset of empowerment? Reflect on these questions, sitting in stillness, listening to your heart. You are so worth slowing down for.